Amen. Hallelujah. The word of God will be found this morning in the book of John, St. John, chapter 2, verse 19, and also in 1 Corinthians, chapter 15, verses 54 and 56. I'm going to ask if Apostle um, Sherelle Friesen would be my scribe and would read for us whenever she's ready. The beginning of God's most holy and righteous word starts as such. John chapter 2, verse 19. Jesus answered and said unto them, Destroy this temple, and in three days I will raise it up. First Corinthians 15th chapter 45th, 54, sorry. First Corinthians, the 15th chapter, 54th verse through to the 56th. So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written death is swallowed up in victory O death where is thy sting O grave where is thy victory the sting of death is sin and the strength of sin is the law. Amen. Let us go through the throne. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank thee for thy word. We thank thee, Father, for thy anointed word. Lord God, we thank thee for that presence. We thank thee, Father God, for this celebratory day, Father God, that you have ordained and blessed us. Father God, we ask that you continue to feed us the word this morning. Feed us that manner, Father God. Open up our minds, our hearts. Open up our ears, Father God, that we can perceive and receive thy word. Lord God, we ask, oh God, that you anoint the man's servant, Lord God, speak to him and through him, Father God, that he would give us and you would give us, God, hallelujah, the things that we have need of, Father God, for this hour. We forever give your name the praise, honor, and glory, which is right for thine. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And you go to the next one, Apostle. Amen. Hallelujah for a title today. Hallelujah for the title of today's sermon. I'm going to um, give you the test of a God. Hallelujah. The test of a God. Hallelujah. And for a subtitle, something I never really ever use as a subtitle. Um, for the subtitle, I'm going to say, he got up. Hallelujah. He got up. Amen. Hallelujah. And amen. Apostle, you can go ahead and make me full screen. Hallelujah. Giving honor to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Giving honor to God for he is worthy to be praised this morning. He is worthy to be adored. Hallelujah. He is worthy to be lifted up. Hallelujah. I understand that today is Resurrection Sunday. Hallelujah. And I understand, hallelujah, that last Sunday was Palm Sunday. Hallelujah. The contrast between last Sunday and today and, and resurrected something and resurrected Sunday is two different contrasts. Last Sunday, hallelujah, was the was, was what we, we call shouting Sunday. That was the time in which we got happy. Hallelujah. We had our palm leaves. And those who didn't have their palm leaves, we had our palms in our hand. We waved it and we shouted before God. Hallelujah. 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 So and, and today is Resurrection Sunday. It is not as exciting as a as Palm Sunday is. Hallelujah. It's Palm Sunday. We get to shout. We can shout. We get to dance. We can praise God. But Resurrection Sunday. Hallelujah. I understand it's just a little bit different for Palm Sunday. Hallelujah. Resurrection Sunday, people don't tend to shout as much as they would on Palm Sunday. On Resurrection Sunday, people come to church. Hallelujah. They come to church dressed in their Sunday best. They might have their Sunday hat on. Hallelujah. And they're ready for the, the church Sunday morning, uh, Sunday parade. Hallelujah. So they don't want to shout because they don't want to mess up their hair. Hallelujah. They don't want to shout because they, they, they don't want to lose their hat. They don't want to shout. Hallelujah. Because they don't want to get their Sunday best messed up hallelujah so if you didn't shout last week i'm sorry you missed it i understand it i i know the poor call i know what sundays are for i know what the sunday is for so i know that the sunday is not a shouting sunday hallelujah 
Hallelujah. It's not a Sunday that we generally devise to shout to, to praise God. I know that this is a, a little, you know, I got to go see grandma today and I got to go see mom and, and we're having dinner at grandma's and at granddad's today. So I got to be a little um, reserved. I get it. I understand. I get it. 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 You don't want to go over there and your hair all discombobulated. You don't want to go over there and your hat all and your clothes all ripped up and sweated. I get it. I get it. I get it. So you get and shout last week. Hallelujah. You, you, you missed it. You, you just might have missed it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My goal today is not to make you shout this morning. My goal today is, hallelujah, is to do what Resurrection Sundays are for, to do what Resurrection Sundays do best. Hallelujah. And that's to feed you. Hallelujah. That is to feed you and to make you full. Hallelujah. For some of you right now, getting ready to go to grandma's house. Hallelujah. Getting ready to sit down at the table with granddad and getting ready to eat with mama. Hallelujah. Getting ready to eat with daddy. Hallelujah. So some of you are getting ready to eat right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The, the, the thing we look forward to, uh, Resurrection Sunday, we look forward to eat. It is one of the most eaten as holidays. Hallelujah. Some of you have turkey. Some of you have ham. Some of you have roast. Hallelujah. You're ready to eat today. Hallelujah. So today is not a shout day. Today is an eating day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And, I'm, and, and so my goal today is just to feed you, just, just to feed you, that you eat on the word of God. Hallelujah. My goal is to give you food and let you eat. Mm, hallelujah. Of the word of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm hoping, hallelujah, and I'm praying, hallelujah, that when it's said and done, hallelujah, when it's said and done, hallelujah, hallelujah, you, you, you'll be full. I want you to be able to go to your mom and your, your granddad, hallelujah, and say, you know, when they, when they put the food, when you say, oh, I just had a little bit. I'm already full. I just, just give me just a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm already, I'm already, I'm already eating. Hallelujah. The pastor fed us today, and I'm not that hungry because the pastor already fed us. Hallelujah. And I want your mom and your dad and your, your grandparents to be like, why did, why did you eat? I did all this cooking, and you telling me you, you're not hungry? I did all this. I done spread the table. And what do you mean you're not hungry? You just have a little bit. So I tell you what you do. This is what you should do. This is what you do. This is what you do. You, you got to eat because you, they, they slaved over the stove. They, they cooked this holiday. So you, you got to eat something. You can't go over there and say, oh, I'm, oh, I'm not hungry. I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell you what you do. Take your, little, take your plate and just put your little tats on. Just put a little tats and then when you, you get the black eyed peas, I want you to, to spread it around. When you get the greens, spread it around. Make your, let your plate look like it's full. But, 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 but that's because you, you got to eat. I understand it. You don't want to offend no one. Hallelujah. You got to eat. Hallelujah. But my goal today, hallelujah, is to feed you so much. Hallelujah. That, when you, that, you, that you'll be so satisfied. Uh, oh, oh, I'm satisfied. Walk in, your, walk in your grandma's house. Walk in your mama's house with a toothpick. Mm, 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 mm. I ain't that hungry. Pastor the fattest, I'm, mm, mm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not that hungry. Hallelujah. I, hallelujah. 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 Jesus, 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 Jesus. Hallelujah. When he met the woman at Samaritan at the well, he met the woman at the well. The disciples left him. Hallelujah. And went into the city to buy victuals. Hallelujah. Jesus done preached so much to the woman and to the people. That when, when the disciples came back, Jesus said, oh, I'm, 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 thanks, guys. I already ate. I'm already full. I'm already full. And they're like, but what do you eat? No, thank you. My, my meat was the word of God. I'm, I'm full. My meat was the word of God. Hallelujah. So that's all we want to do this morning. You might not get a shout on this morning. Hallelujah. But I want you full. Hallelujah. I want you full on the glory. Hallelujah. On the word of God. Hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. I understand this morning also that I'm, uh, I'm under a little time constraint. Hallelujah. We got to a, a late start. Hallelujah. But the, the Holy Ghost had his way to this morning. And I praise God for it. So I understand that I might just be on a little time constraint. So I promise to, to get you out. I promise it to not be before you long. We might be done right around what? Two, two, three, three o'clock. Jen is usually serve at three. We might be done about three o'clock. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. And amen. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 The, the first lady that looked at me like, you ain't going to be done at 3 o'clock. I'm going to be done at 3 <laughs> You're going to be here by yourself. Ah, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On this high holy day, Resurrection Sunday. Hallelujah. The testimony that we stand on, stand firm and flat-footed. Hallelujah. That he got up. Hallelujah. He got up. Hallelujah. The, 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 the tomb is empty. They went to the tomb looking for Jesus, and Jesus wasn't there. Hallelujah. 
Jesus wasn't there. He, hallelujah, he, he got up and, and took his grave clothes. And, and the Bible said he folded his grave clothes. And, 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 and he didn't run out like, like you and I would have done. He folded his grave clothes. Hallelujah. The door was open to, and, and, and I had a chance to get out of the tomb. Hallelujah. I would, I would have come running out of there. But Jesus took the time. He folded his grave clothes. And, and then he nicely put it down. And he just strutted out. Hallelujah. Strutted out of the tomb. He wasn't in no hurry. He was God. Hallelujah. He wasn't scared. He wouldn't have to, he didn't have to run like you and I would have. Hallelujah. He just uh, left out the building. Hallelujah. Strutted out the building. I told you, no one takes my life. I lay it down and I pick it up when I'm good and ready. I told you that. Hallelujah. Why didn't you believe me? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So this is the time. Hallelujah. Resurrection Sunday. Hallelujah. We come to praise God. Hallelujah. Just seven days ago, hallelujah, Jesus made his triumphant entry into the city of Jerusalem. Just seven days ago, Jesus, hallelujah, got on the donkey and he made his way, hallelujah, into Jerusalem. Hallelujah. hallelujah. It, it blows my mind sometimes when I think about it. When I think about it, Jesus knew all that he was about to partake. Jesus knew all that he was going to get to. He was he was going to face, hallelujah, and yet he got on the donkey, hallelujah, and he, and he, and he just rolled into Jerusalem, hallelujah, as people shouted, Hosanna, Hosanna, he knew, hallelujah, and that, 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 that by that, this time, next week, hallelujah, I, 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 I'd be transformed, hallelujah, and yet he still came, hallelujah, he knew that when he entered in Jerusalem Sunday morning, seven days ago, hallelujah, 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 he knew, that they was going to pull him to a mock trial, and, he, and, and they were going to strip away and pull away his hairs of his beard. He knew that. How, he knew that they was going to spit on him. He knew that they were going to smack him with the palm of their hand. And yet he still came into the town. He yet he still came in. Hallelujah! I'm gonna tell you what you would have done. I'm and what I would have done too. Hallelujah! If I knew that I was going to go into Jerusalem, if I knew seven days later I was going to five days later, hallelujah! On Friday they were going to string me up. I mean, I, that, 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 that mule, I'm telling you, that donkey, uh -uh, I will turn that donkey around. Come on. I wouldn't have did that. Hallelujah. But yet he came on in. He knew. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. That five days later, hallelujah. Hallelujah. They're going to take a cat of nine tail and they're going to whip him. Hallelujah. 49, 40 times save one. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And yet he still came into the city. Hallelujah. He knew, hallelujah, that five days later, they was going to, hallelujah, they were going to take the the, uh, uh, the, the the cross full of thorns off of it uh, and, and strap it to his already beaten back. And he was going to have to bring it into the city, bring it into uh, God, uh, parade through the city to Golgotha, hallelujah, with the thorns and the wood sticking them already in his flesh written back. Hallelujah. And yet he still came into Jerusalem. Hallelujah. 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 And he knew that they were going to take nails and, 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 and nail his hands to that cross. He knew they were going to put nails in his hands and nails in his feet. Hallelujah. And she had to stretch him wide and hang him high. And yet, he still came into the city. Ah, hallelujah. Who wouldn't serve a God like that? Hallelujah. He knew they were going to take him down and lay him in a tomb. Hallelujah. That they was going to mock him. The same people that was crying, Hosanna, today is crying and shouting, crucify him tomorrow. Hallelujah. And yet he still came into the city. I'm telling you, I would that donkey be turned around. Let's get up out of here. But yet Jesus still did it, knowing this. Hallelujah. Why? Who wouldn't serve a God like that? Hallelujah. Ah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because he knew seven days later that grave, hallelujah, that tomb wasn't going to hold his body down. He knew, hallelujah, that he's going to rise in victory. He knew, hallelujah. In spite of all that, hallelujah, he knew, hallelujah. He did it, hallelujah. Not just, he did it, hallelujah. Not for just his word. He did it, hallelujah. He did it. Not, hallelujah, hallelujah. I'm going to take it first. He did it for me. He did it for me. He, 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 yeah, you can hey, say he did it for you too. I don't, I don't mind sharing, but I have to look at the testimony and take it personal. He did it for me. He knew hell wasn't made for no David. David wasn't made to go to hell. Uh uh, hell is just too hot. Hallelujah. Ain't nothing in hell that I want. Hallelujah. I don't want hell on earth, and I don't want hell in hell. 
Hallelujah. So he died. Hallelujah. He did it for me. He came in. He didn't turn that donkey around. He came in. Hallelujah. He hung, bled, and died just for me. Destroy this temple. Hallelujah. In three days, and I'm going to rise it up again. Hallelujah. Destroy it in three days, and I'm going to rise again. Hallelujah. No man could take my life. I lay it down. Hallelujah. And I pick it up when I'm good and ready. Who wouldn't serve a God like that? Hallelujah. I lay my life down, and I pick it up. Hallelujah. Don't you know if I wanted to, I could call legions of angels? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who wouldn't serve a God like that? And yet there's so many people refusing to serve this God. And yet there's so many people choosing other things. Hallelujah. To, 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 to serve as God instead of the risen Savior. Hallelujah. Be careful what you choose to serve your God. Hallelujah. Be careful what you choose to serve as a God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. The test of a true God, the test of a true God, hallelujah. A true God has to has to have to have to do four things, has to overcome three of the four things. The first thing a, 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 the, the, the true God, hallelujah, has to do, he first has to be alive. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He first has to come alive. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You don't serve a dead God. Don't serve nothing that hasn't experienced life. Hallelujah. They can't instruct you if they haven't experienced life. They can't instruct you if they haven't experienced grasping at breath every second you got. If you don't serve a God, they, think they ain't got the testimony or the experience that you have. The first thing that, the, that, that, that a God has to do, he has to experience life. He has to experience the pain and the disaster and the disappointments and the despair of life. The first thing a God has to do, the test of a true God, he has to experience life and all that life has to offer. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The second thing, hallelujah, that a true God has to do. Hallelujah. The second thing that a true God has to do, hallelujah, the test of a true God, the second thing that a Messiah or a, a, a God has to do, he has to overcome death. Hallelujah. He has to overcome that, 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 that force that, that, that snatches the body from the spirit, that force, he has to overcome that force that, says, uh, uh, that separates them, that force, he has to overcome death, that takes the body. Once the body has been, the, the, the life has been snatched from the body, he takes the body and he starts the process of decaying within the body. He starts making sure that our body cannot be used again. Hallelujah. The, the, uh, the test of a true God has to overcome death. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Watch what you make a God. Whatever you make as a God has to overcome death. If it can't overcome death, how do you think you're going to be? Able, it's going to be able to save you to overcome death. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah it has to overcome death. The third thing, the third test of a God, the third test of a God, hallelujah. The third test of a God, hallelujah. It has to be able to overcome the hell it has to be over once the the, the 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 soul of a person been snatched from the body of the person and the body start that decaying process that soul has to be able to experience the 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 the, 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 the abyss of hell uh hell that snatches you into the underworld that separates you as far as you can get separated from God. That hell, hallelujah. The Bible tries the best. The, the, the Bible tries the best way to ex, to explain what hell might be like, so we can get some type of phantom of ideal of what hell might be like. It says you imagine yourself in a bottomless pit where darkness is so dark. Hallelujah. It is so dark there that the darkness chokes you. It is so dark that you it's so dark darkness chokes you. You're in a bottomless pit and you're falling and you're turning and you're trying to grab on to something stable. You're trying to grab on to something stable. Hell, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Where the stench of sin stink. Hallelujah. They call it how to how they call it brimestone, brimestone, brimestone. Hallelujah. Where the stinks of sin smell so bad. Hallelujah. Hell. Hallelujah. Ah. The Bible try to get you to understand where the worm and the cake of worm doesn't die. Hell. Hallelujah. Try to, to try to paint a picture of what hell what it could be like so we can try to understand in our mind, hallelujah, the, the God that we serve, the God, the thing that we choose to be God, whatever we choose to be God has to be overcome hell. If it cannot overcome hell, how do we expect it, hallelujah, to help us to overcome hell? Hallelujah. Ah, hallelujah. 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 The fourth thing, the fourth thing, hallelujah. The fourth thing, the test 
of a God. If anything claiming to be God, if you're trying to make something, you, you got the fourth thing that that, 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 that deity has to overcome to prove that it's God. The fourth thing is it has to overcome the grave. Hallelujah. That once death has snatched the body, the soul from the body, and the body's dead to can, and, and took the soul down into hell. Hallelujah. It has to overcome the grave. That, that grave, that grave that locks the living from the dead. That the grave, sometimes they put a stone in front of it. Sometimes they put you in the ground six feet. It has to overcome the grave that holds you down. Even if you could, how even if you could, even if you could, even if you could, how to overcome hell, even if you could overcome death, that grave is gonna hold you in in chains. Hallelujah chains of darkness. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Even if you could do the other four, uh, it, you still have to overcome grave that holds you into darkness, that holds you and keep you from separating from keeping you separated from life and the living. Hallelujah. Be careful of the things that you make your God. Hallelujah. Be careful of the things that you you bow down to worship. Be careful of the things that you put up on the pedestal and make your God. Hallelujah. The Bible says, hallelujah, the Bible give a good example. The Bible talks about, hallelujah, the Bible give an example, hallelujah, of a, of a person who, who made an idol or made something else as God. He said, the person that made something else as God takes a tree. Hallelujah. And from that tree, they chop the tree down and they take a portion of that tree and they warm themselves by the fire with it. They take another portion of that tree, they put it in the oven and they make a cake or something. They make they cook their food with it. Hallelujah. They take another portion of that tree and they build them a home with the tree. Hallelujah. They take another. The tree is subject to the tree cannot stop them from chopping them down. The tree cannot stop them from putting it in the fire. The tree cannot stop them from putting it in the oven. The tree cannot stop them from hallelujah from using it to make their homes with. Hallelujah. And they take a fourth part of the last part of the tree and they make themselves an idol. Be careful what you make. Hallelujah. Be careful what you make a God. They make this, they took this piece of wood, this tree, they carved in it. Hallelujah. They carved in it. The Bible said, Hallelujah. They gave it eyes, but it could not see. They, they, they carved ears in it, but it could not hear. They carved hands in it. But it could not handle. Hallelujah. They call her mouth, but it could not speak. Hallelujah. And they bowed themselves to this image that could not do nothing for them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Be careful what things you put in your life to make an idol over you. Be careful of the things you put in your life to become a God in your stead. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't be, don't make a God in your life, hallelujah, that can't hear you when you cry. Hallelujah. Although they might have ears. Don't make a God that can't see that they can't see what's coming down the line. And they can't give you guidance and vision. Don't make that a God, honey. Don't make a God that can't speak into your life. You have a mouth that can't speak. Don't make a God, hallelujah, hallelujah, that 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 have no hands and it can't deliver. You might have hands, but it can't deliver. You don't make that thing a God. Don't make that a thing God. Hallelujah. And they take this God that they have this image of this God that they made, hallelujah, and they walk with it. Hallelujah. And in times of trouble, they grab this God and they run in with it. They run. The God can't deliver them. They got to save the God. Don't make a God something that can't deliver you in time of trouble. Hallelujah. They can't deliver you. Hallelujah. Don't make that thing a God. I don't care how shiny you, you make the wheels. I don't care how shiny those 22s are. I don't care. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't care. I don't care how much wax you put on that. Hallelujah. Don't make that thing a God. Hallelujah. I don't care how many zeros, hallelujah, are on the right side or the, the, the left side, hallelujah, of the decimal point. I don't care how many zeros are there. Don't make that thing a God. I don't care what your bank account say. It can't deliver you in time of trouble. Don't make things a God. Hallelujah. 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 Don't make that thing a God. Hallelujah. It doesn't pass the God test. It didn't pass the God test. One, it wasn't alive. Two, hallelujah. It didn't overcome it didn't overcome death. Three, it didn't overcome hell. And four, it didn't overcome the grave. It has no right to be a God. And I, hallelujah. The stomach as a deity or a God in your life. Hallelujah. So don't make things a God. Hallelujah. And I'm almost done. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Bear with me a few more minutes. I'm almost done. I know that the hour is fair. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And don't make people your God. Hallelujah. Don't make 
people, your God, don't put people in a position, hallelujah, that, 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 that God deserves. Don't put people in positions, hallelujah, that Jesus alone deserves. Don't put people, hallelujah, hallelujah, don't put people in, in, in those positions. Hallelujah. I don't care how eloquently they can speak. I don't, good, I don't care how good and divine they look. Don't put those people on pedestals. Don't put those people, hallelujah, hallelujah in, 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 in the places that only God deserves to be. And only Jesus deserved to be. Don't make them idols. Don't make them people of God. Hallelujah. Buddha can't help you. Hallelujah. I'm sorry. Buddha cannot help you. And I know I, I'm probably not supposed to talk about other religions, but I got to tell you, firm and flat footed. Buddha, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Buddha can't help you. Hallelujah. Don't make something your God that sit time. The only way this person was able to, hallelujah, was able to reach the standards of Buddhism, hallelujah, he had to go and isolate himself away from everybody so that he couldn't be tempted. Hallelujah. I'm going to, I'm going to isolate myself. That way I can't be tempted. I'm going to starve myself. That way I can't be tempted. Don't make a God that can't participate in normal society. Hallelujah. I got to put myself away in isolation because of a girl or a woman or someone or a man walk by, I might just be tempted. Hallelujah. I'm sorry. Hallelujah. 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 Muhammad can't help you. Harry Christian can't help you. You can't meditate yourself into Nirvana. Hallelujah. And get away from everybody. Hallelujah. And hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm sorry they, they can't help you. Don't put people in a position that only Jesus Christ himself could fear. To feel. How do you, don't 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 worship man. Don't worship man. Don't make man your God. Don't make man your God. Hallelujah. 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 Don't make man your God. I hear you though. I hear you. I hear you. Someone is saying right now. Hallelujah. But but the pastor freezing. Pastor, wasn't Jesus a man? Ah. Wasn't Jesus a man? You were right. Yes, Jesus is a man. Hallelujah. But what makes Jesus different from Buddha? From 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 from, from Harry Krishna? From, 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 from Muhammad? What makes Jesus different? Hallelujah. What makes him different? Hallelujah. The difference is he got up. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Buddha died and he still did. He didn't pass the he, they, they might have passed the living test. Hallelujah. But they, they didn't pass the death test. They still did. They didn't pass the hell test. They still in hell. They didn't pass the grave test. They still in the grave. None of them testified that we got up. They, they got up. Hallelujah. Only Jesus can testify. Only Jesus can say, hey, he got up. Only Jesus can say, hey, I am here. I did it. Behold, I am he that was dead. And behold, I'm alive forevermore. Ah, uh, Hallelujah. He got up this morning. Hallelujah. He got up. That's what we celebrate in the day. He got up. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He passed the God test. He passed the deity test. He got up. Hallelujah. He alive. He understand what I've gone through. He understand the, the disappointment. He understand the disappear. He, he got up. Hallelujah. He understand. He got up. He got up. He got up. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Ah, uh, he got up this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He passed the God test. Ah. Uh. Make a God out of someone that passed that he passed the God test. That's why we pause and celebrate Resurrection Sunday today. That's what we do. So when you go home huh, and you go about your ways and you're eating, hallelujah, and you're eating your meal today, hallelujah, remember, ah, uh, he got up. Hallelujah. My soul is satisfied. Hallelujah. Because he got up. My soul is full because he got up. Hallelujah. I, I'm not serving a dead Savior. I'm serving a living and risen Savior. Hallelujah. I'm serving. Hallelujah. I'm not stuck on Friday. Good Friday. Hallelujah. I'm not stuck on Good Friday where he hung on the cross. Hallelujah. We used to sing a song. Hallelujah. We used to sing a song. Jesus, keep me near the cross. Jesus, keep me near the cross. There I left my sins. Jesus, keep me near the cross. There got to come a point in your life where you got to see beyond the cross. You got to get beyond Good Friday. Hallelujah. And get into the victory of Sunday morning. Ah, uh, Get into the victory of resurrection. Yes, hallelujah. On Friday, that was a victory. Hallelujah. Yes, he hung, bled, and died. Hallelujah. But hallelujah, I got to get beyond the cross. Excuse me. I got to get into victory. I got to get in triumph. I got to see my God. And Isaiah said, I saw him high and lifted up. And his train filled the glory. Hallelujah. His train filled the room. Everything that he conquered filled in behind him. Hallelujah. Everything, when a king comes into the, 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 the city, when a king comes, the train is everything that he conquered. Um, Isaiah said, his train filled, his glory filled. Everything that he conquered followed in behind him. Death had to get in line. Hell had to get in line. Hallelujah. 
The grave had to get in line. These are the things that I conquered. Hallelujah. He got up. 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 And this, hallelujah, you praise God. And this is your blessed hope. This is where your hope lies. This is where your faith lies. He got up. Hallelujah. He got up. And because he, because he lives, I can face tomorrow. Because he lives. Hallelujah. 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 Our fear is gone. Hallelujah. Oh, grave, where is thy sting? Oh, death, where is thy victory? You, he, he got up. Hallelujah. Oh, grave. Hallelujah. And I'm done. I'm done. I'm going to cut. I'm going to end it right here. Hallelujah. There's more to say. Hallelujah. But I pray God that he give me another chance to, to continue. But this is enough. Hallelujah. This is enough good evening right here. That is enough good evening. Hallelujah. Still take your two people. Mm, mm, mm. Pastor really. Mm, mm, mm. Wow. Mm, that was good. And Pastor really fed us this morning. Hallelujah. Pastor, mm, mm. I, I just take a little bit because Pastor fed us this morning. And I don't want to hurt your feelings. But I'm really full. Ah, oh, My food was the word of God this morning. That manner. Ah, uh, thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you for the word, hallelujah, Father, that went forth, Father God. I thank you went forth the anointed word with power, full of grace, and full of truth, Father God, hallelujah. Bless the hearers of the word, Father God. Not only the hearers only, but the doers also, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father God, as they pause this day to reflect and to give you thanks for giving up out of the grave, that we can get up, Father God, on that blessed Sunday, that resurrection day, Father God, how that rapture day, thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Now, Father God, at the sound of my voice, Father God, anyone, hallelujah, that is in need of prayer, anyone, Father God, that is in need of deliverance, Father God, anyone that is in need of salvation, anyone that is in need of healing, Father God, meet them where they're at, Father God, meet their requests, Father God, open up the windows of heaven and bless them, Father God, and we forever give your name to praise, hallelujah, honor and glory, Father God, right now, in Jesus' name, we praise and thank you, hallelujah, thank you, Father, amen, and amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, hallelujah, with all hearts and minds are clear, let us go to the throne of God with the benediction. Hallelujah. With, with, with clean and open hearts, uplift to the hands. Hallelujah. Repeat after me. Hallelujah. What I say unto one, I say unto all, watch, pray, take time to live holy, and read your Bibles. Go on the grace of God, hallelujah, as you celebrate this day with family and friends, hallelujah, let it be with love, let it be with peace, hallelujah, remembering, hallelujah, that he got up. In Jesus' name, go on the grace of God, amen. We love you with the love of God, amen, and amen. Yes, Lord, amen. Thank you, Father.